when we hear the word detachment, most of us will imagine a monk in the mountain with a very empty look like this. And he does nothing. He sees nobody. He has no girlfriend, no friends, no social life, no object with him. He just is sitting, doing nothing and being nothing. But I want to let you know today that detachment does not mean this at all. Let's see it this way. You are aware that this shirt is yours, but one day it might go away. You might lose it. Somebody might steal it away from you. But if you just are aware that it is here now and it might be gone, you are detached because you do not cling to it intensely. And the same goes for people in your family, for your friend, your girlfriend, anything in life. If you just are aware and you do not live in the delusion that this person or this thing will be here forever, you are detached. But let's go to the source. How to be detached? How to actually do it? Because just this understanding definitely it's on the right path, but it is not the whole thing at all. So let's go to the very root. All of your experience of life, your perception, come from this human mechanism, your awareness. Therefore, if you become detached to the body, to the mind, to your ideology, then you will be detached from everything because all else is a perception coming from this. And once you just accept that, you came on earth to learn. You are not a human body. You are not a male or female, a Canadian, an Indian, an American. You are a soul that is driving, using the human system then how is it even possible to be attached to it? When you understand all the limitation to which physical life takes, give you, there is no way to be attached. Therefore, my best tip that I can give you is to enhance your perception. Don't try to force yourself to be detached from somebody or from yourself. Because if right now you are not, it just means that the energy within you did not rise enough. Because remember, there is seven chakra within the human system. Well, seven main one. And the last one of those seven is Sahasra, known as the crown chakra. And when your energy rises all the way up here, you are connected to everything. You are connected to God's source, to all multiverse, all people, all events, everything that exists. And in the same time, you become fully detached. And the reason is, detachment and connectivity is not too opposite. They come together. Because you can never be connected to anyone or anything when you are attached to them. Because you live in fear, in lack, and those emotions are the lowest energy possible. And if, let's say, you have a girlfriend, you love her so much, you are scared to lose her, you are scared that she'll find another boy, or one day she will die, you will be alone then constantly you will have this lame energy within you. But if you are aware right now that it is only for a short amount of time, because even 100 years is so short in such a vast cosmos, and when you just know, any second it could be taken away from you, then you will do your best in the present moment to give your love, to be fully present, to enjoy to the maximum potential.
So remember to be detached, just rise your energy, your perception will enhance. And if you want to do this, this practice right here is going to highly help you. Alone by itself, I cannot tell you how much it will do. It will be incredibly useful. But if you would like to truly transform your DNA, change your system, not just become a better person, a better ego, but to transform your life by using several ancient yogic practices in a specific order daily will totally change the game, liberate you from the mind, allow you to be the master of your emotion, creating them on command. If this sounds interesting to you, then start Spiritual Growth Academy today. It is here for you, available. If you have any more question about detachment, let me know within the comment. Thank you so much for being here.